months ago. I've learned that I've done something that I had no intention of ever doing, something terrible. I have actually victimized children by looking at these images. I didn't realize it at the time, but I definitely realize it now. That's former 10 TV meteorologist Mike Davis addressing the court earlier today before Judge Karen Phelps sentenced him to prison. Davis pleaded guilty to child pornography charges earlier this year. We thank you for staying with us at 5 o'clock. I'm Brad Johansson. And I'm Darlene Hill. Davis will now serve at least four years in prison, but could serve up to six years. We have team coverage of today's sentencing. NBC 4's Dan Perlman with reaction from members of the Internet Crimes Against Children's Task Force. But Ted Hart leads us off with heated moments from inside the courtroom this morning. Ted. Yeah, you know, the judge said more than the 16,000 images involved in this case, it was the time that she found uh, more troubling. The seven years that Mike Davis spent downloading, collecting these images, and then hiding it from family, friends, and coworkers. I promise you, Judge Phipps, I will never. Uh, look at these things again. From behind his mask, Mike Davis apologized to friends, family, and former TV viewers. But the judge pointed out that until today, Davis had never voiced concern about the child victims in the 16,000 pornographic images he had downloaded over a seven year period. You refer to the children as it, and you compare the collection of offensive, illegal pornography of the abuse and repeated abuse of children to the same as toys, comic books, and wine. Davis was arrested last September and was promptly fired from his job at 10TV as chief meteorologist. Defense attorney Terry Sherman argued that Davis has been attending therapy sessions and that his crime is better suited for rehabilitation than imprisonment. He never sold it, he never distributed it, he never made it, he never did anything but look at it. Davis claimed he didn't know that by downloading and viewing the pornography, he was re-victimizing the children. Despite what I've heard people say, and it kills me to hear them say it, I've been terribly filled with remorse once I realized what I did. The judge was unconvinced. I do not find the claim that you were unaware of what, that what you were doing was a crime or illegal to be credible whatsoever because you hid it, you did it in private, or you would have been caught a lot sooner. And Davis will serve, serve a minimum of four years and up to six years in prison, followed by five years probation, and he'll have to register as a tier two sex offender for 25 years. Local for you and live in Columbus, Ted Hart, NBC4. All right.